ladies and gentlemen, it's me, T-Bone. Welcome to the Warno, your, uh, your precursor to the weekend. Letting you know about some things going on that you might be interested in. We uh, do the Warno every Friday night starting at 6 o'clock here on Facebook Live. Uh, using a commemorative cup. This commemorative cup here comes from the Khaki Ball in Rota, Spain, year 2015. It was a great year. It was my first year as a retiree still emceeing the khaki ball. Our beer recommendation tonight comes from Timmy. Uh, Timmy is a diehard Natty fan, and uh, I picked up some Natty, and uh, I got some Natty. But I'm not going to punish you. I'm not going to make you sit through the entire... It's too much. It's too much. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> so uh, we're going to take that Natty down to size just a wee bit. You know, these, these things remind me of my youth. <laughs> you can get two of these monsters, two of them, for $3. $3! I spent twice as much on the cheese to give my dog. That wasn't for you. That because this has got a lot of head, and uh, I had that grovelly in my throat, so I needed to knock that out real quick. You know, you know it would be nice if the producer was here and then she could read comments to me so that I wouldn't get distracted trying to read comments. That'd be an awesome thing. It would be very helpful. You think that's, that's too much, isn't it? Don't worry, I won't talk about anything important until the timer's set. Something you never want to see your bartender do, right? <laughs> no, it's uh, it's down there a little bit. And as they say, it's good enough for government work. So uh, the warning order, as I said, occurs every Friday night at 6 o'clock. It lasts the length of one beer, and we talk about events in and around the greater Harrisburg metropolitan area, or wherever you may be. we got listeners all over the world. So if you've got something going on in your section of the world you let, and you want to promote it, you let me know, and I'll share it with other people. It's very burpy -ish. <laughs> and, and And instantly, the bubbles disappear. I, I want to give you all of me. All right. I, I believe we... <laughs> You're watching now, but you weren't watching when I was talking about you. Tonight's beer is brought to you by you, Timmy. It's a natty. Uh, drinking natty because of you. Thank you for that. Uh, it is not good beer. <laughs> when, you, when you are interested in quantity over quality, get you a natty daddy. Get you a big old can of natty. Look at that thing. It's huge, man. In my youth, we used to drink these things called Master Cylinders. It was Schlitz Malt Liquor Bull in the 24-ounce can. I can't find that anywhere. Maybe I'm in the wrong neighborhood. I'll have to see if I can find that for a future taping. Anyway, let's talk about what's going on this weekend. Tonight, you can expect a release of the latest episode of The Lunds B Show with T-Bone and Chick Brew. I am... Um, in the process of editing that, I should have it done uh, relatively soon after this, and it will be released for the fans of the show on the fan page of Facebook. You can find that by searching the hashtag LUNSB, or you can see it on Chick Bruce's page, or you can see it on my page later, after. Uh, fans get first dibs, but if you subscribe to us through any of the podcast things out there, a Apple, Pandora, however you get your information, uh... When it pops, it pops, and you get notified either way. Hello! Mm. So that's what's going on tonight. Not a lot. Uh, finishing up editing the Lunds B Show with T-Bone and Chick Brew. Getting that out on the streets for your entertainment. What's going on tomorrow, T-Bone? Excellent question, viewer. Let me tell you what's going on tomorrow. Uh, 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 boom. Weather depending. Because I don't know about you. But here in central Pennsylvania, we done got douched. We, we got mega douched. It, the douching continues. 
<laughs> so uh, the uh, Enola Fire Company, excuse me, Enola East Pensboro, I think it's Enola, Enola or East Pensboro, Volunteer Fire Company number three uh, will be doing another uh, chicken cookout tomorrow starting at 10 o'clock. Same date, same time, same location. You can't miss it. It's at the corner of East Penn Drive and Wurtsville Road, right there at AmeriChoice Federal Credit Union, or AmeriChoice Credit Union, or whatever it's called. It's in the parking lot. They got the fire trucks out. You'll smell it from miles away. For $12, they'll give you half a chicken. They'll give you a roll. They'll give you some applesauce. I feel like there's a fourth thing. And a potato. I believe a potato. Don't, don't hold me on. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it's a potato. It is. It's a potato, it's chicken, it's applesauce, and, and, and a roll. And, and they throw in like a, a little pat of butter in there too. That's $12, and proceeds go to support the Enola Fire Company, Volunteer Fire Company, number three. These people are volunteers, so they have to do fundraisers to fund their volunteer effort. Make a day of it. Go on out there. There's usually, hey, Rob. Let me say it right there. I got the Helgersons. They always seem to make me happy. Uh, my Siganella family. Uh, Rob, my Siganella family. And uh, yeah, we got a lot of people watching tonight. That's always fun. So tomorrow, Worksville, East Penn Drive, AmeriChoice Federal Credit Union. It costs 12 bucks. Plus, I think they do a lemonade thing. I think there's a special lemonade fundraiser that may be off to the side. Don't know. I'm promoting the chicken. Go and enjoy the fire department chicken. Because, you know, firefighters really don't do much except cook. They're very good at cooking. And occasionally putting out fires and making calendars. But not, not the volunteers. The volunteers don't make calendars. That's uh, The full-time guys make calendars. Speaking of full-time guys, if you're a firefighter in the greater Harrisburg metropolitan area and you're looking for a job, we're hiring. We got some positions for firefighters right here at NSA Mechanicsburg. Not only is it a firefighter job, it's a federal firefighter job. And let me tell you, brothers and sisters, it don't get no better than that. Speaking of brothers and sisters, ha, ha, ha. That's tomorrow starting at 10, should be done by noon. They do sell out, and it's good. I, I've, I've supported them on a couple of occasions. It's not bad chicken, I'm telling you. Timmy! Now, that's uh, Friday night. That's Saturday morning. Moving on to Saturday evening at the Harrisburg Comedy Zone. Harrisburg Comedy Zone located at 110 Limekin Road. It's right off of 83, right there in New Cumberland. You can't miss it. It's easy. In the uh, Boomerang Hotel Casino and Resort. <laughs> it's a big place. So you got the Comedy Zone located inside there. Tomorrow night, you got the, the old Anderson boys. and You got Arn and Oli and Tully and... Woo! Ric Flair. You got the Four Horsemen, but not those Four Horsemen. The Four Horsemen of Kami is, uh, let's see if I can do this uh, in alphabetical order off the top of my head. Uh, you got Andrew Glessner. That, that's uh, number one. You got uh, Michael Donald, number two. Uh, QRS. Uh, Damian Robinson, number three. And Manny Santiago. Those are four great comics. They're doing a great show tomorrow night. Harrisburg Comedy Zone. You can get your tickets in advance by going to HBG Comedy Zone, Harrisburg, abbreviated, or you can spell out the word Harrisburg, ComedyZone.com, and then I'll link you to the Eventbrite, and you can go on there and get your tickets, guaranteed seating, in advance. Or you can risk it. Roll the dice. Let's see what happens, right? You go to the door, you pay your $15, you get in. I've been supporting a lot of Comedy Zone events lately, and uh, not really enjoying uh, too much. If you want free tickets, I'm not prepaying. I'm not prepaying. I'll be there. You find me, and if there's still tickets available, I may buy you a ticket. Or I may buy you a drink. There may be some, in, in, a, in the weirdest version of Where's Waldo, we'll play Where's T-Bone. You're going to go to the show. You're going to watch four amazing comedians. Oh, and a fifth one. There's a freebie in the mix. He's not one of the four horsemen, but he will be your MC, Aaron uh, uh, Lennon Free. A very funny guy. So you got five very funny people to watch tomorrow night. Comedy Zone. Doors open at 7. Show starts at 8 CP time. Uh, tickets are $15. Buy them in advance. They're a little bit more. Buy them on site. $15. Bucks. Uh, find T-Bone. And uh, I'll get you a beer. 
or uh, a ticket or a pleasant conversation. I don't know. It all depends on how I'm feeling. That's tomorrow. That's the morning. That's the afternoon. That's everything going on Saturday. Dan Warner. My Puerto Rican family. <laughs> I was just thinking about you, Dan. Uh, because Roger just celebrated his anniversary. The man has been married to his wife, Bonnie, forever and a day. And me and Dan and Roger and Dennis, we were... We were all together in Puerto Rico at one amazing moment in time. I got to be with great people, and it was a great time. In retrospect, not so great at the time, but in retrospect, these are men that I truly love and admire, and uh, it was great to know them at that point in time and at this point in time. I love you, Dan, and I don't say that to everybody, but I should. I should say it more often. So you got your Friday night, you got your Saturday, rolling into Sunday. What's going on Sunday, T-Bone? Again, great question. Uh, the supplemental. 10.30s, Sunday morning, we do the supplemental. What are we going to do? We're going to talk about your national days of the week. We are going to do a community service event or community service note or send something out about the community, usually. And then we're going we're gonna to have fun and we're going to play a game called This Week in History uh, where we do seven trivia questions to date. None of us have gotten all seven trivia questions right. And I've asked AI to make it kind of easy because my friends are dumb and I'm dumb. But no, we haven't, we haven't got it done yet. So that's what's going on. That's Sunday. I burped. <laughs> this, this, this makes me burp a lot more than the other stuff. And by the way, if you have a beer recommendation, if you have a beer you want me to drink uh, on the Warno, send it in. Please find one that doesn't have as much carbon dioxide in it. Monoxide. There's a lot of bubbles in the how old natty here. Send that a hey, I see Monty. Monty Allen, great comic, ladies and gentlemen. You ever get a chance to see Monty? See Monty. One of my favorite jokes of all time. I he said it 24 years ago. I still remember it. I still tell people his joke, and I absolutely give him credit for it. And it was uh, Monty going to his first NASCAR race. I've never forgot it. It's a great joke. Thank you, Monty, for being there and for making me laugh all these years. So you got your Friday night information. You got your Saturday night information. On Sunday, it's the supplemental. That's at 1030. That's those three things. Uh, I don't really have anything going on right now with the, uh, the veterans of comedy, but we will make it an opportunity to share anything that's going on with the veterans of comedy. It's an organization I uh, wholeheartedly believe in. They're moving towards being a nonprofit. And they're doing more and more things uh, for veterans. So these are, these are veterans who are also veterans of comedy who've been together for over, over 10 years now and they're making great things happen. So to our friends at the Veterans of Comedy, we'll always put out something uh, if there's something available to put out for them. So that pretty much wraps it up. I've told you everything I need to tell you. What's going on Friday night? What's going on Saturday night? What's going on Sunday? And uh, that is what the Warno is. Just a little heads up. Uh, a little positive mental attitude to get you into your weekend and to have a beer with friends that I haven't seen in forever and a day. Any Irish red, he says. I did the Killians, Tim. Oh, that's right. You're never here on time. But uh, I, the next time I do a beer and I'm thinking of you, it'll be a Killian's red. That pretty much wraps it up. Check it out the comments. Looks like we're good to go. Um, I remind you today as I remind you every day. Just be the best person that you could be. And if you were a great person today, be an even better person tomorrow. Chick Brew, of course, sends her love. Try to stay dry. And cheers along with me for that final sip. Arriba, abajo, e centro, e parentro. Stay safe, everybody.